don't care. It's pink. Hello, welcome back. Yes, it's Drift Bugger 72. Right, this is going to be the Drift Bug, so to speak. Um, yes, I'll be. I'm, I'm using an old TLO one chassis, and these are just demo wheels, they're not staying on. Um, literally, I, I can't get the pink off for the love of money of me. I don't know why it won't come off. I tried everything. It must be good paint because it's not coming off unless it was, I don't know, it won't come off anyway so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to stick some mounts on it and I'm going to turn it into a drift bug and it's also got clear front so I'll make some lights some out of that, you know what I'm like, I'll sit with it and make some clusters but that goes on there like that and it's not far off to tell the truth, it's just... Yeah, a bit like that, you know. It's not bad, is it, really? So anyway, there'll be that'll be the next project. Uh, making a drift mini. Um, got my eye on a car. A viewer is showing me, and I'm really interested in it because it's an idea I've not tried out yet. And also, I'll be working on a snow plow. Yes, you heard me right. I'm going to try and make an articulated chassis by using a few bits and bobs and I need to sit there and work it out because literally what, I, what I'm going to try and do is cut one of these in half cut it clean in half in the battery bit there and then I'm, I'm going to design some kind of steering mechanism and what I'll do on the shaft there I will actually Put um, a, uni a universal joint in there, put a drive shaft joint in there, or I might come up with another idea, which is, well, it's an idea. But yeah, I'm going to make myself a, well, like a loading shovel, caterpillar loading shovel with a scoop on the front. But it's not going to have any hydraulics, it's just going to have up and down because it's like a snow plow. Um, I've seen the track ones, I like the track ones, but I think. It would be cutting in my own chassis into my own chassis and making articulation with it and change the way it goes into four wheel drive. I've got a few ideas. Um, somebody come up with a really good one, so I might probably do what they said. Um, because I want to match the speed, because I want it to be not really quick, but I still need the, the right transmission ratio to drive the front wheels and the back wheels so it can dig into the snow uh, because it well ploughed the snow out of the way because I don't want a really fast motor so I need more of a rock crawling motor but what's this space I've got a couple of ideas um, the way I'm going to put the drive shaft in here and I put a joint in it so it can articulate but I have to do something to this but yeah so there you go that's it everybody um, that's drift Bugger 72, or Booger, as a snot, so to speak, to hate the colour pink. But there you go, what do you think? I think it looks quite nice in with my... What the crap was that? Anyway, with my little ideas i come up with, and I've got to trim the body shell a bit more, and I've come up with an idea for something, I'll make my own light clusters. But this will most probably just be a slow drift car. And believe it or not, I think I'll learn more off that than I will do with Euro Drift because Euro Drift is too quick. That's why she's getting changed back into um, a racing car again because she just doesn't want to drift. It's just too powerful and I don't really know what to do. But when I've got a really crap car or slow car, I can drift. It's weird, isn't it? Um, so, literally, that's it. So. Hope you like that. I do. I got little bits and bobs from what it is. Done up to my standards yet. There you go, peeps. Hope you like it. How very low. Uh, sorry about that. Be honest. I'm just feeling really tired all of a sudden. Um, maybe enjoy them, but this is going to be. I've also got. Hey, wait a minute. I can actually show you if there is somewhere. 
I've actually got the bumper and everything, but I'm gonna I'll, I'll come up with some kind of idea. I might even put a man inside the cockpit, you know, to give the take your eyes off the pink. You know, I know it's pink, but it's got speckles in it, so it's like golden pink. And you make well pink, but yeah, it's pink. But I'm gonna go stupid on it. I don't care, nobody likes it, you know, but there you go. Right. Also, I've got no body mounts for the TLO one. And I'm not robbing any and I'm not buying them either. Because they just can't afford them. If Wild Dagger's watching, or he's been watching, Wild Dagger, this is few, but Wild Dagger Z fucking, I don't know, bollocks anyway. Um, have you got any TLO1 body mounts? Anybody got any body mounts? Do you want to swap for a couple of LEDs or just want to, you know, donate them to me? I'll do an unboxing for you. Um, I need the body mounts, the body's posts. And I went to buy them, I thought. I'm not paying ten pound, and that I've had that many. I usually keep about eight behind for myself when I'm doing projects. And when I buy these in, so I buy these in the sell these on eBay, you see. And I get some good ones, even though the the basic like that's that's excellent, right? So I decided to um, start selling them back on. I was making a bit of a loss, like, but now I wish I didn't. Give away too many body posts there and got this. If anybody body posts, can you inbox me and we'll sort something out, please? Because I really want to get this on the road this week. Well, not this week, but you know, I want to get on the road before Christmas. Uh, but yeah, that's that's Drift Bugger 72. Or is that, yeah, I call it Drift Booger 72. Drift Bug, innit? Or Drift Bugger 72. Anyway, there you go. Um, have a nice evening everybody and speak to you soon.